Hi, I am Chad from Shadow Geek HD and what's this video all about? This new video on explain series. So what's the topic is? The topic is screen resolution. Well after all, everyone is asking me what screen resolution, what's that P in that 720p and what's that I in that 1080i. So all the answers will be explained in the video, so let's get started here. So, so first of all, I have to conclude the myth. So people are asking, what's the P in that 720p? So I would say the P in that 720p is progressive and the I in that, that 1080i is interlaced. So what's this P and interlaced? These are not off topic, they are a bit generally concluded and are a bit connected. So let me tell first about the progressive. So in a TV, if you look, there are horizontal pixels and a vertical pixel. Generally in, in P that's progressive, you have the full pixels, whereas in I, it has a half pixel. So that is 1080i and 720p are similar in typical practical usage so i think that concluded that much so let me tell something about the pixels and resolution so i won't only go with the youtube's pixel or the youtube's resolution that is 360p 240p 480p 720p 1080p and 4k and not going any substandard that is wvga wxga wga that's our present in the phone that is what is 418 to 800 240 to 320 they i will not go with that so first of all let me tell you so 240 p what that means 240p is equal to 240 into 320 so if i suppose this is the vertical pixels and this is the horizontal pixels so the horizontal pixel is less than less so it is the 240p that means the horizontal pixels will be more and the vertical pixels will be less so that's 240 into 320p whereas 320p denotes the vertical pixels and the 240p denotes the, the horizontal pixel so let me come to the next resolution that is 360p so 360p denotes 640 into 480 as actually 640 is equal to the vertical pixels and 480p is equal to the horizontal pixels. Now I'm coming to the next resolution that is 480p. 480p is 480 into 800. That you can also open the the big denotes vertical and the small denotes horizontal pixels. Okay, so watch uh, if I add the I. So if I change this into interlacing resolutions, what will be the change? So you can estimate that if it's 240 into 320, it will be half of that. So the clarity will be less. So these are some of the techniques that are followed by the TV marketing strategies. So in India, for some of the brands ruin the television by telling that 1080i people think that 1080 is big but not that's the right scenario the scenario is that 720p and 1080p 1080i are a bit similar and are and i would say a shocking decision is that 720p is more better than 1080i so when coming to the next part the big part that is 720p 1080p and 4k in 720p you have 1280 into 720 and in 1080p you have 1080 into 1920 so well done what's happening next is 4k a bit higher resolution in 4k you have 2160p or we call it as 2160p that is 3840 into 2160p so well Charlotte, how do we denote 4k how can we make it assure that it's 4k 4k means that the vertical pixels must somehow reach the 4k standard that is 4000 pixels now but as a tv standards or the conventional use or for convenience TV marketing makes that makes that 3840 is approximately 4K, but we know that. But it's a standard kept by the Indian, so we cannot change it. And 2K also defines that it will be near the 2000 pixels. I think this explanation solved some of the problems that were in your mind about 4K, 2K, HD, Full HD. And I have to say, Full HD is denoted 1080p, and HD is denoted at 720p. And also, the as per the law, if the resolutions increase, the better the screen quality. I have to follow that and that's it that was the explanation on screen resolution and if you like this video please click that like button as well as if you dislike this one please click that dislike button as always i will probably accept it so if you want me please subscribe I'm out of subscribers please help me a lot in my youtube channel otherwise i cannot provide this i am on lack of funds so that's it i hope to see you in my next video <laughs>